16, he said, So I am eager to come to you in Rome too, to preach the good news. And this is another introduction statement. I'm eager to preach the gospel in Rome. I'm not avoiding Rome because it's a difficult place for Christians to be. I'm going to get there. And eventually he did. And then in verse 16, he says, Another I am that we've already looked at. For I am not ashamed of the gospel. And why is he not ashamed? Because it is the power of God that brings salvation to everyone who believes. So the gospel doesn't tell us about the power of God. The gospel doesn't show us the power of God. It is the power of God to everyone who believes. And Paul isn't ashamed of it. See, what happens in churches sometimes is that the gospel is so countercultural that a church may tend to water it down a little bit. We try to make it a little more palatable. And as a result, we settle for something inferior, some feel-good emotionalism or some shallow self-help. When a church starts to be ashamed of the gospel, it's usually because it's more concerned with being relevant than about revealing the righteousness of God and redeeming the brokenness that's all around us. Here's the key. What makes our church relevant is not that it's like our culture. What makes the gospel and our church relevant is that it's not like our culture. Let me read that again. What makes our church relevant is not that it's like our culture. What makes it relevant is that it's not like our culture. So what makes it relevant isn't lining up with popular opinion. As a church, we don't try to stay relevant by softening the gospel of God's word so that people will more readily accept it. There's a long and growing list of churches that have become more irrelevant because they've tried to be relevant. In trying to be like everyone else, then they don't have anything to offer. Broken people come to the church and then they think, well, This sounds like something that I could hear anywhere else. I could have just stayed at home in bed. As a church, we're concerned about trying to sell what God wants us to sell. We're not concerned about trying to sell what everybody else is selling. 